doubt now. Judgment has been delivered. Elixir. I have no gill for that. You think you can be One more. Don't you go busting up our ruins. Ah, it's another one of those annoying little guys. We are on one more, right? One remaining. It's so annoying when it takes forever. It's like when you don't want to fight them, they always spawn. And when you want to fight them, they never spawn. Fine. Ugh. Really? What? I just kill it.
Whoa, what the? I don't plan on losing. What is this? Skeleton Omega. It's immune to poison. is doing only one damage to him. That did 56,000. Staggered and only does one damage? Wow. Okay, let's do this. You think you can be forgiven? I will. Okay, let's do this. Fight evil. Ah, he healed from that. So annoying. This is odd. So when he's like this, he still can't be playing. Kill me again, and you again. Okay, we're gonna have to overhaul him again. gonna do that. Chaos Sword for some reason is still able to deal damage. to die. 
die. It's so annoying, that stupid. Mog does. Mog, do something. He doesn't even do anything. Oh, it actually went for Mog. I won't go easy on you. Now, you think you can be forgiven? What? I can't get him lower than 25%. Ridiculous. Every time he does that stupid blood sword thing. Why can't he get lower than... Well, he's slowly dying. Dumb fight, though. Still not dead? Finally! Better get ready for the next fight. I'd use everything. Harbinger of death. Was not expecting to fight that guy. <laughs> Score of one. Score of one. Defeated every skeleton. Curse level four. Bone cracker. So this is basically the skeleton weapon? Deep Protect Chaser makes physical attacks like attack more effective against enemies afflicted. That's actually really good. I had to use my turbo ether for that though. Oh well, we have enough EP to teleport to Yusnan, so we can still talk to the lady. Alright, where is the- I need to get to the guy first. That 50 skeleton thing better be a rank 3. 
Oh, that was actually pretty surprising. That caught me off guard. I wasn't ready for that. As you can tell by how I had to waste all my items, including the Turbo Ether. The revenge you always wanted is complete. I destroyed every last one of the skeletons that got your kids. You did it! You got revenge for me! Thank you! I knew you were the right person to ask! Do you feel better now? Yes. I suppose I do. But it's still not the same as having my kids back with me. That's the way revenge goes. Yeah, you're probably right. But at least it saved me from pickling myself to death. You're done grieving? I'll never stop grieving. But I feel I can face the grief head on now. I don't want to be living in a bottle when the world ends. I'm gonna go visit their grave and tell my kids about this. I can't do much more to thank you, but at least take this. Pioneer's eye patch. Really? That's all you get from this? 4,500 gil. more unappraised items you know what let's unappraise them first or let's appraise them first let's unappraise them yeah uh let's appraise them first because maybe like maybe one of them will be an ether or something if you have anything for me to want me to appraise anything odd for you nah, so you said it. come back all right how many how much guild do i have now Twenty five thousand. Oh, which are you taking? Come again. What are you after? Get one remedy there. You better make it back alive. It'll whip you off in a flash and all things to Alright, let me just check whoops, let me check the quest line thing. So really Arrow Knight, which I wasn't able to do. But I was able to do the skeleton one. And then we'll be able to do this one again. So let's go back to her. Or just use the EP ability to teleport. We'll have to find a turbo ether off of an NPC. This day 12 turned out to be a really long day because of all the grinding monsters.
So I tried your latest concoction. It worked well. Better than I was expecting. <laughs> that is most gratifying to hear. Then the name was well chosen. Miraculously, the Miracle Nectar works. I have succeeded, but I cannot rest on my laurels. I shall give you another task that is something of a diversion. In science, sometimes you must step off the path of pure research and hack into the jungle of commerce. What are you talking about? A diversion? You're starting to lose me with your metaphors. My research requires expenditures, flasks, buns and burners, liability insurance, etc. I need new revenue streams. You want me to help you make money, is that right? Bluntly put, but in essence, yes. Exactly. I want you to be a spokesperson for my latest product. This is the concoction that you previously tested. I'm rebranding it as the Nectar of the Gods. Catchy, don't you think? It's yours for free, and I can even offer a guarantee. What do you want me to do with it exactly? You already know it works, so you don't need me to just test it, do you? I want you to participate in the battle arena. Then, in battle, you must drink the nectar in front of the entire crowd. What? If all those people see how well it works for you... Then they'll come flocking to buy their own. Exactly. They'll see you drink the potion and think that it will make them as beautiful and powerful as you. Oh, how they'll be clamoring to give me their gill. And it's all for the sake of science, right? Science? Would you... Ah, oh, yes. Yes, of course, for science. That goes without saying. Really? It's not done? Man, I really wanted that quest to be done. And now it's too late to do this. The lists are closed. The st yeah. Because that skeleton took too long. So we have no time. We can't do that. Uh, that's lame. Oh, it doesn't give enough EP. I thought I thought if I killed the guard, he'd give me like EP enough that I could teleport, but apparently not. Oh well. Discover, come in and transform yourself into a brand new you. <laughs> that was random attacking that guard like that. Man, all the debuffs are like that. Well, we have a lot of level 3s. I guess really the only thing I need to do is level boost them. But I need the Malice Stones. See you! Don't miss your chance. We've got the finest stock... Come back soon.
Yeah. But the lizard tails was for a, uh... It was for, like, a... What do you call those things? A sub-quest thing. We won't be able to get there now, because we're out of EP, so I can't teleport. Oh, I, oh, well, I can go that way. But that's, that'll, that'll take too long. I'm a splendiferous and magnificent. For it, right? Or a lot of credit? Or all the credit? Here for the train? Yeah, that'll. Uh... I don't know if there's anything left for me to do in Luxurian. I really thought that was going to be over, this quest. I'm kind of annoyed that that's still going on. So I couldn't beat Aeronite, but oh well. Let's see, 53, so I completed 53 side quests of 48 Canvas of Prayers. Are you taking the train? This will take us to South Station. But there won't be enough time to go back to the Dead Dunes. So I'm just gonna talk to Chocolinus here and see if there's anything I can turn in. Oh, this is North. Oh, yeah, North Station. Never mind. Choco, lighten up, brighten up. Let the whole world see what you can do. I really wish that, well, I hope on New Game Plus, the reward is known. I don't like how it has the question mark there, because then it's like, is it worth doing the quest or not? It's just kind of, it's just random. Because for some of them, like in the Wildlands, you have to collect those flowers, and then some of them are actually for the sub quest and then some of them for this type of quest it's kind of annoying not knowing what the reward is so that way it's, it's hard to prioritize which ones to do first wait till you see what i have in store for our world's very special one and only savior More shops. Where did she get it made? You have half an hour until you'll be transported back to the Ark. Yeah, at least I accomplished some stuff. I, d I turned into a bunch of those little... What do you call those things? Canvas of Prayers? Did a bunch of those. 
So 50, 50 canvas of prayers. So it managed to get 50 canvas of prayers by the end of day 12 and 53 side quests. I don't, I don't know if that's good or not. I couldn't really find, oh wow. Today, the City of Light has been the scene of much tragedy. A great number of our residents have lost their lives. Let us offer prayers once again to Great Beneveza, so that he might be merciful to the forsaken souls, they who have lost all hope of seeing the new world. I don't know what the maximum amount is. The final bell tolls. The twelfth day is over. Beyond 13. On this final day, please hear my last prayer. <sighs> this is it. This is the true light of Yggdrasil. One day till the end? Did it say that on day 12? <laughs> what? Are you doing okay, Light? What? One day left? Wait, that was day 12, right? Yeah, day 13, one day left. What? <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Equilibrium. Equilibrium Plus, Dark Muse, Dark Muse Plus, and Miss Wizard, Miss Wizard Plus. So those upgraded? Oh. What changed? Attack 4? Attack became 4. Greatly hastens ATB. Whoa. I didn't know what prayer I answered. <laughs> what prayer did I answer? I didn't beat Aeronite. I didn't I didn't really do anything. All we did was like we literally only completed the skeleton thing. That's it. That's like the only one I did. I failed to beat what's his name? Uh and I apparently am not done with this. That's really interesting. So there's one day left. What's going on? <laughs> oh, Skeleton Omega shows up here. 
We got zero stuff if we fight this guy again. So the last ones show up in the challenge battles. That's cool. Noel, Snow Plus. I hope this carries over into New Game Plus, this list here. So I can fight like the different ones, like regular Snow, and Noel Plus, and Caius Plus, and Prandis Plus, or whatever the other ones are. Parandus, this thing was that this this was originally defeated by Noel and Sarah. This this used to be this was like Aeronite. This was like a floating orb in Urba in 13.2. And then it was I remember it would summon a bunch of annoying Seath enemies to help him out. It was a really hard boss fight. It was an optional boss fight. So the last ones drop really good items. That's nice to know. So this is day 13 with one day beyond. So there's 14 days. So that's probably why I got that trophy. I'm not sure how I unlocked that. I guess it must have something to do with the total number of side quests and canvas of prayers. Because I have 53 and 50. Someone was saying... I think it was... Anthro was saying, like, you'd have to do 40 of them? For the... But I thought that was for the 13th day. So, I, I don't know. But that's the cool thing about first playthrough. You have no idea what to expect going in. You just play it, and then it's like... You remember it that way, I guess. Around 43, okay. So I guess I went a little bit overkill. 53. Overachievement. Yeah, apparently I have 14 days. It's, it's day 13 and there's one day left, so that's gonna go to day 14. I get a lot of stats. I get a lot of stats. What does that mean? So I'll be able to beat Arrow Knight? I was thinking like, oh, Equilibrium Plus. This is gonna... This is gonna make me so OP. Like, I'll be able to kill... I'll have like over 2,000 attack and 2,500 magic. I'll be able to kill Arrow Knight. So easily, but apparently not. Well, I guess we get another chance at fighting Arrow Knight. Like a whole nother- there's a whole nother extra day, which means that how- what am I gonna do on that day? There's nothing to do. Probably go back to Dead Dunes. And then, uh... I don't know. There's nothing- there's- Oh, there's- oh, this. I'm gonna do this. Oh, but I can't do that until the night time. It's the tournament thing. Oh, that's interesting. So I get another chance of completing this thing. On New Game Plus, does these don't carry over, do they? Like, they're not going to be checked off and we have to do all of them again. Yeah, they probably, probably don't carry over. I would assume they don't. Like, for example, like this one. I failed this one. Because I talked to the guy at like 12.01 instead of 12 or 11.59 or, or something, he got mad. I thought this was going to be like a really easy one. You talked to him at 12 and then I think when I click, click the button, it moved. <laughs> it moved to 12.01 and he, he's like... I hate you. Anyway, well, that was a three-star quest, I guess, because you have to be precise or something. And this one, we read the guy's diary, so he got mad. 
but it worked. The interesting thing, you read the guy's diary, but then it opened up some other... This one, eventually, and then I get the Dark Knight garb from that. Well, anyway, that's gonna be it for this stream. That was day 12. We'll be back with day 13. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do, because it's gonna be a weird... It's gonna be a weird day. I mean, there wasn't... Like, day 12 was really... Just farming monsters. I, I don't know what I'm gonna do for that whole 24 hour block. Oh well, we'll see. Alright, thanks everyone for viewing. We'll be back with uh, day 13. Well, there's not a whole lot of side quests. There's really nothing left. Well, there's still all these canvas stuff, but, you know, like most of these. Really, probably the, the three star ones are the only ones worth doing. But we already did enough of them to get to the 14th day, so I don't really know. Well, whatever, we'll see. Ultimate Lair? Ultimate Lair. I don't know if I have that one, but whatever, we'll see tomorrow. Yeah, we'll see. Tomorrow's probably gonna be interesting. I have no idea what I'm gonna do, uh, but uh, we'll see. There's probably gonna be some cutscene when she goes back down the teleport thing. We'll see. Alright, guys, whatever. Thanks for viewing. We'll be back tomorrow with day 13.